The Sleep Donard Hotel was built by the Belfast and County Down Railway in 1898. It's 112 years old. It had been built for the luxury hotel destination at the end of the 19th century. And it's from there it, it really shone as a, uh, as a destination for the city of Belfast with the advent of the railway coming to Newcastle. The vision for the hotel was to be a premier resort hotel in the island of Ireland and uh, to do this we needed to relaunch the hotel back to what it would have happened in the close of the 19th century and to bring it up into the beginning of the 21st century. It had been tradition in the past when the hotel was built that old Turkish baths and hot seaweed baths and things like that so it was a return to the old values of the hotel. It was the investment of £15 million and it was to make the hotel what probably to be the Glen Eagles of Ireland. You get the five star experience when you come here. Um, you also are able to um, get the experience from both the leisure floor and the treatment floor. The leisure floor um, will give you the beautiful views um, of the Irish Sea, the Moor Mountains, which is unique in itself. Um, and if it's quietness and tranquility you want, well then you can enjoy our relaxation areas, so you can choose between both. Basically it's the, the, the five star experience that you will get when you, come, you visit us here. We have the added um, value of the, in the hotel with obviously having the spa attached, so someone was coming for a corporate meeting then obviously they, you know, they, they do get free time, so uh, a huge market there would be obviously they would come and use the spa um, but also the fact of obviously a lot of companies nowadays are looking at the, the energy saving as to how you know we participate in how you know saving the energy um, in the hotel and um, recycling that sort of thing because there's a lot of companies now that that's one of the questions that they ask um, and we would be involved you know in a great deal with that. We recently won an award for best wedding venue um, just in or the past year, um, so it would be a, a huge piece of our business in the, the peak wedding season. Um, so it would be important for us obviously to, to do the wedding fairs um, through the, the six hotels that we have. We appeal to a lot of different market segments, everything from American golfers and top end spa breaks through to local weddings, residential conferences and tours. The unique feature to the sleeve, I suppose its location is a huge factor and the uniqueness of the building being over a hundred years old but it's the fabric of the building itself but right down to the details within the hotel in the recent extension um, we try to source where possible a lot of local products from the moor and granite that we use in the fireplaces through to carpets being provided by Ulster Carpets. Uh, we feel that that gives a touch of the Northern Irish feel without going down the Twee um, tourist route. The relationship with Royal County Down um, is quite a close relationship. The golfers um, are a high revenue spend. Um, they go across to Royal County Down obviously to play golf, but then there's additional spend with the revenue as to dining, drinks, um, and also obviously the spa treatments as well. We have many golfers coming here from America, and it's Americans alike, malt whiskies, especially you know the Irish ones. So, and we bought uh, quite quite a few whiskies in for the Americans. See, our customer expectations are five star. We are four star hotel, but we have to deliver five star service, which we always try to achieve through um, training. We always try to employ the best stuff available and just customer service is very important for us. Staff development is, uh, and promotion is key to the success of the place. Um, if for instance, in the Oak Restaurant, Irvin, who joined us some five, six years ago with the ascent of the European Union, he was from uh, Croatia, and uh, he joined us just as a station waiter. 
and he worked his way up and today and now through his dedication to the job and, and our personal development of him through courses, he now is assistant restaurant manager. So I mean we encourage this very much so that our, pe that our people are given the opportunity for personal development. The tourist and the hotel industry is hugely competitive and hugely fragmented and quite often your website is the first point of contact that any guest has with a hotel. Um, it really is a case of first impressions count because you might only have 15 to 20 seconds to get a guest to convert to make a booking whenever they visit your website. Uh, the home page is obviously essential but things such as special offers, best rate guarantees, they will all affect the number of online bookings you get. We have links from our website to TripAdvisor and more and more anything we do with eShots and everything will focus on, you know, come and look what other people say about us. It's, it's like having a third party endorsement. We would hand out cards to all guests leaving the hotels that encourages guests to leave um, notes or points about their stay on TripAdvisor so we feel by being transparent we have nothing to hide. If we are encouraging you to write about your stay at the Sleeve Donard we feel that only has positive implications for the hotel. I think it's all about the personal touch engaging with the customer or the potential customer if you can show that you're not just another branded hotel group who takes business for granted and that you really care for the guests needs prior to their arrival at the hotel or more importantly after their stay because if they go away with a bad impression of your hotel it doesn't matter how much you spend on marketing your brand they will tell more people about a bad experience than a good experience. People's perception of the sleeve and what it was five or ten years ago is very different now. We launched it as a resort property and it's the destination sale, it's not just a hotel, it's about everything you can do at the sleeve and in the surrounding area. So working very closely with Northern Ireland Tourist Board um, and the local tourist providers and even um, third party companies, we feel that you're giving a people a reason to come to Newcastle and to visit the Sleeve Donner. What makes every experience special is the people that you meet and uh, I mean, the, the friendliness and openness of staff and the willingness for everybody to go that extra mile and to, to ensure that the experience that the customer has in the Sleeve Donard is special. Well, the Sleeve Donard is the largest um, hotel in the area um, with being 178 bedrooms. So we would have people coming to work for the hotel, coming to stay in the hotel. We've even get guests that live around the corner who just come away for a wee break. Um, and there is a couple that lives around the corner. And we keep asking them, you know, why do you come to the Sleeve Donner? And they say, well, why, why drive miles when you've got it on your doorstep?